Hi everyone and welcome to my channel. So I am Iman Fandi and today I am going to be answering some assumptions about myself that I have asked over Instagram story. So I am just gonna look through my laptop for those um, assumptions and I will be answering them. So let's get into the video. So the first assumption is you are a pretty chill and down to earth girl. I guess so, yeah. You have trust issues. I don't think I have trust issues. Cause I feel, I always believe that if someone does something to ruin that trust, then that's on them. And then we can deal with it then, you know? You wish to have a sister. So I did used to want, to, want a sister when I was younger. And I always wished for an older sister. But then as I got older, I was like, nah. I don't want to share things and I don't think I wanted a little sister as well and I'm kind of like fine now because I have so many brothers and it just made me think like oh I'm gonna have so many sisters-in-laws anyways so it's like I can see them and they don't have to stay at my house so <laughs> you hate math so I did hate math um, but then I started to like it and the reason why I hated it was because I didn't really understand like why is there so many formulas just to get to one answer or that kind of thing and um i have this problem of sometimes when i read numbers it flips so let's say the answer is 39 but then when i want to write the answer it becomes like 93 so i always have that problem yeah but i'm okay with it now you are scared of spiders no i don't think i'm scared of spiders i just don't like insects but i'll just leave it if it comes around you have to exercise every day. No, because I haven't exercised in the past week. But I like to just keep myself moving and I do things to make my feel, myself feel good. So at least I still like, if I don't exercise that much, then at least I'll like eat healthy or something like that. You have always wanted to be a model. Yes and no, I guess, because fashion has always been like something I wanted to do. And I guess, yes. Like, I have always wanted to be a model, yeah, since young. Um, we have so many assumptions to get through, so... Ha. Okay. You are probably a very deep sleeper like me, so when you wake up with... So when you... Wait. You're probably a deep sleeper like me, so when you wake up, your hair becomes a jungle of hair. I am actually a very light sleeper, so any form of light, even like my door, and if the outside light is on, I can like, even though even though my eyes are closed, I can like see the light shining into my room and I hate it. Or like sometimes I have things charging so that like the plug that's on has a light, so I hate it, so I have to cover it with like a blanket or something over. And, but yes, when I wake up, my hair does become like a um, you don't smoke. Yes, I do not smoke. You will be moving to the US. No, because I am not moving to the US. <laughs> you had good grades in your school. Yes and no, because I think when I used to live in Indonesia, so the school curriculum was very different from when I moved to Singapore because over here it's a bit harder. So when I moved here, I was actually failing math so bad. like. I remember, I think out of 50 or 100, I got five. Like five out of 50 or like five out of 100, something like that. And I was just like, ooh. That, that was very bad. So my English was still passing. My science was still passing here and there, you know? But then I slowly got better and like I got um, used to the curriculum and like how the system works. And then I, I always told myself, as long as you try your best and like you pass, then okay. So I passed my PSLE? Okay, good. I passed my O-levels? Great. And then um, I made it into like doing my diploma. So I finished my psychology diploma and now I'm finishing up my degree. So, I mean, right now my grades have been doing better with like psychology, of course, because it's something I'm interested in. But since like primary school and secondary school, all of those like, um, you know, those like mock tests and mock exams, I would fail them so badly, but lucky the f the real thing, the finals and all that, like PSLE and O-levels, I would do good, so it got me through. <laughs> yeah. 
You can't speak Malay. Yes, I can. I can speak Malay, but um, it's very bad. Like some of you guys would say, it's rabat. <laughs> and I get. I don't really speak it that much because I sound weird, and I think I sound like funny, so I don't speak it. But I can understand. So there's been so many instances where people think I don't understand, and then they talk, like. I've had instances where I was like in the lift and someone was talking about my hair and then I, I understood every single thing that she was saying so when I left the lift, I turned around and then I just said thank you and then I walked out You yawn like a pig Yes I do Okay, when I yawn, I have to just like get it all out It's, it's a reliever That's from a friend by the way You're good at playing te tennis Um I don't know. Like, I think I'm okay. Mm. Um, you excelled in literature in school, but not so good at math. I didn't do literature. Or did I? I don't know. I cannot remember. But you're right with the math thing. I didn't do that great in math. But then I started to improve, so... Your accent is fake. So I don't know how to reply this. I get, like, it's just how I talk. But I guess no, because if it was fake, that means I'll be like faking my entire voice all the time and they'll be so tiring, right? And sometimes I do speak Singlish with my friends, but yeah. You know, when you like meet people and stuff, I, I, be, I try to be formal when I first meet people and I guess that kind of stuck. You are pudding. No, I'm not. You are low man maintenance. Yes and no. So I have those times where I really don't care. I'm just like, uh, anything goes, that kind of thing. But then sometimes I'm like, I want, I wish I could do, I need this or I need that. But then again, I only really want it or need it or need to do it if I really need it. Or need to do. Or really want it. It depends. I don't know. <laughs> Is that it? I feel like I have more. You can play football. Yes, I can play football. You're comfortable. You're more comfortable speaking English than Malay. Yes, that is true. I thought you're in high school. So when I saw this, I was just like, <laughs> that's good. Like I still look young, I guess. Um, but you thought I was in high school. I am not in high school anymore. I guess it's considered at university because I'm finishing up my degree. I mean, if you guys want to know, I'm 20, so... You actually prefer going out bare face than full face of makeup. So true, because I prefer just like natural and just like nothing on my skin, that kind of thing. Um, yeah, I don't know, because I, I, I feel so lazy when I have makeup on and then I have to take it off. But I like doing makeup because it's like a form of therapy, if any of you can agree. It's just like, mm, okay, mascara, now it's the foundation. That kind of, I like the process. But I don't like it feeling like sticky on my face or like especially now with COVID all of us have to wear masks so I don't really wear makeup except for now because I just went to dinner I mean to a lunch um yeah you're a big family person yes yes I yeah I mean what does big mean but yes I I am a family person I like hanging out with friends I like hanging out with my brothers I like staying at home and last one, you love makeup. Yes and no, because um, like I said, I like, I like doing like modeling and being in the fashion industry and like changing up my looks, that kind of thing. But I don't like having to put it on every single day. So it is a yes and no. So that is it for answering you guys. So that is it answering the assumptions that I asked you guys to ask me on Instagram. And I hope some of you like this little video. I know it's a little bit quick and just answering questions, but I thought, why not? I saw it on Instagram, I saw it on YouTube, so why not try it out? And I hope I answered some of you guys' questions as well. Um, and yeah, thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe and yeah, have a good day.